A determination to ensure space for the ancient Hindu tradition in the new society of Trinidad and Tobago. And today, firmly rooted with a strong external presence and a continuous internal vigor, maintaining its source of authority and responding to every challenge. A tradition that enriches our diversity through rituals, festivals and philosophy, the Hindu way of life. The ancient Hindu practice of yoga is increasingly being embraced by the entire world, recognized as a system of physical, mental and spiritual teachings in response to every situation and temperament. Sri Vasudeva of the Blue Star Ashram at Claxton Bay provides an insight into yoga. Yoga the very word is a Sanskrit word that means union. And uh, what is uh, interesting about this word, it not only means the process of union, it also means the path to union. So it's a word with a double meaning, the process and the path. And uh, the process of union is a process of uh, merging of our individual self with what we call our cosmic self. In yoga exercises, we learn to energize the endocrine system of glands, and these are very important in the functioning of the human body. We learn how to remove stress from the body. We learn how to create circulation in every area of the body. And in yoga as well, which is an additional benefit to ordinary exercises, there is an advanced form of breathing exercises. They are called pranayama. And these breathing exercises supercharges the body at a level of vitality or subtle energy that you can't see but you can feel. And it is similar to what the Chinese call qi. Uh, the yogis call it prana. That there is prana in the air that you breathe. And when you breathe in particular ways, you you energize your body with a special vitality, subtle energy, uh, that, uh, that, that really energizes you in, in, in beautiful ways.